Yes, it's Lay here, and for today's vlog, we'll be talking about hashtag adulting. So nowadays, we've been hearing a lot about this hashtag from working professionals, especially when they enter a stressful season. So you know, deadlines, due dates, etc. What's that? Lay, just to follow up your report. Uh, I'm on it, the bus. On my table by Monday, okay? Okay, po. noted. Okay. Yeah. Grabe, kaya pala she always goes to our boss's office. Oo, oh, oh, no. Tapos, alam mo ba, they usually see them go home together. Like, grabe in, talaga. Oh, oh, no. Sobrang imura. Ay, grabe. As in, I agree. So, tanda. What's up? Lay, just to follow up your report. Um, I'm on it na focus. On my table, by Monday, okay? Okay po. Noted. Ano ba? Wait, pero wait ha. We should not be talking about it if we do not have evidence. You know? Evidence pa? Eh, ang obvious kaya. Yeah, I know. Pero, syempre, we should not talk behind people's back. So, it's best pa rin for us to approach the person. You know, ask and clarify. Okay, sabi in responding to gossip in the office as grown-ups, we remember that we are to do the Matthew 18 principle. First, we do not just believe every accusation or story, so it has to be with at least two or three witnesses. Second, we confront the person involved first. Third, if the person would not respond well or participate, we correct or confront the person in the presence of a witness. And lastly, if still not responding, we take it to the leadership. Remember that adding fuel to the flame does not make us better than other people. Participating in gossip can separate close friends, says Proverbs 16, verse 28. What's up? Oh, nice bag. Add card. Wow, ang elegant naman ng blouse na to. Perfect sa Add card ka. And oh, makeup. Yes, I'm gonna try the new sun's face lipids. Add card. Oh, of course. Shoes. With perfect ni color blue. Add card. What's up? But wait, it was just the end of the month and I just finished paying off my bills, rent, utilities. Mm, maybe these things are not for now. Okay, I have to delete them. Delete, delete. Okay. Do you have learned from the previous teaching in church that if you're not careful in buying things that we don't need, later on you will lose what we need to pay off debts for the unnecessary things? Songs of Solomon 2.15 says, Catch the little foxes that ruin the vineyard. And part of adulting is learning priorities in our finances. Enjoying the fruit of your labor is great, but we need to remember our responsibilities. What's not? Inside kita sa birthday ko, dinner, 8 p.m. Sama ka? 8 p.m.? Hindi ko masyadong late naman. 12 p.m. na lang. Atok na atok na ako, 8 p.m. What's hot? Hi! Hi! Birthday ko! Invite kita, dinner, 8 p.m. Ay, anong araw ulit? Bukas. 8 p.m.? Hindi na yata ako pwede nang ganun kalite. Okay lang kaya mas, ano, mas maaga. Pwede kayo ibang time. Ah, tatanong ko. Ano, okay lang ba kayo? Kung nga, kung 6 p.m., okay lang ba? 6 p.m.? Okay, okay lang. Okay lang. Okay, okay lang. Okay. Ayan. O oh, sige, 6 p.m. dinner na lang. Kita tayo, tayo okay. tomorrow. Text 6 na lang. Sige, thank you. What's up? Yes, day off at last. Oh, I love day off. I can sleep and just do whatever I want. Very productive day, so what I did, I woke up early, I cleaned the house, yeah, and I did the laundry. 
And at last, I was able to finish the book I was reading. So, all check for the day. As we grow up, we need to learn to remember who we are now. Ephesians 2 verses 1 to 3 says, As for you, you were dead in your transgressions and sins, in which you used to live when you followed the ways of this world and of the ruler of the kingdom of the air, the spirit who is now at work in those who are disobedient. All of us also lived among them at one time, gratifying the cravings of our sinful nature and following its desires and thoughts. Like the rest, we were by nature objects of wrath. We need to learn to allow God to change the way we think so we can leave behind childish things. 1 Corinthians 13 verse 11 says, When I was a child, I talked like a child, I thought like a child, I reasoned like a child. When I became a man, I put childish ways behind me. The key to hashtag adulting is making a decision that we want to grow and we allow God's word to change the way we think. Because... It is not just about us. This has been What's Hot, What's Not. And if you find this vlog helpful, don't forget to hit like and subscribe.